present Michigan, new users only. You got to wager in the designated market. It, it, we, we just re, go go to sportsbook.fanduel.com. You want all the things. I mean, this is like a paragraph illegal. Gambling problem? Call one 7117 It's Fanduel Sportsbook, the official partner. Ninety-seven won the ticket. Odyssey.com Sports Minute is brought to you by Lalonde Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram. This is Jim Rome with an Odyssey Sports Minute. What part of last night's Hawks Sixers game was more insane? Atlanta coming from 26 down to win or Philly coming from 26 up to choke and lose? Let's go ahead and call it a tie because that was both an epic comeback and an epic tank job. I want to say both were equally unbelievable, but know me i'm here to celebrate and not hate and i'm going to do just that and hype atlanta i'm giving it up to trey young who continues to be an absolute star of these playoffs he had 39 i'm gonna celebrate lemon pepper lou williams who changed that game i can't say enough about how much grit this hawks team is showing right now and how little grit this sixers team is showing do you know how bad you have to be to blow a lead to a sports team from atlanta and the Sixers have done it two games in a row. I'm Jim Rome. Attorney CPA Joe Cordell. Hopefully you and I agree that you should do everything you can to save your marriage. Divorce is hard, expensive, and its outcome is usually not all you hope for. However, when doing everything has failed, when divorce remains as your last option, Consider Cordell & Cordell as your first choice to help you through the divorce process to a better place on the other side. We've been a partner men can count on for more than 30 years. Let us be that partner for you. The attorneys at Cordell & Cordell work to help men maximize their role in their children's lives, which includes protecting men's financial means to do so. Schedule an appointment with one of Cordell & Cordell's Detroit area attorneys, a partner men can count on. 248-825-8080. That's 248-825-8080. Online at CordellCordell.com. That's CordellCordell.com. Offices in Troy and Ann Arbor. Now's a great time to get a new set of wheels during the Kia Trade-In Trade-Up Sales Event. Hi friends, Bill Golly here for Golly Kia of Madison Heights. Tell me about some of the great values. Qualified buyers can lease a 2021 Kia Forte LXS for just $125 a month. This is for 36 months, 10,000 miles a year with 3,000 due assignment. We have over 20 various Fortes to choose from with more on the way. So come visit our new dealership on 14 Mile Road, east of the Oakland Mall in Madison Heights. Remember, move on to Sienna Gala Kia. Check us out online at GalaKia.com. Are you a real estate agent or have you ever thought about becoming a realtor? Hi, it's Mark C. with EXP. We are now hiring. Most realtors struggle because they don't have enough leads or they work day and night with no retirement plan. I have a solution that includes company stock, residual income, and a great compensation plan. Come learn from the best. Me, Mark C. at joinmarkc.com. Scan the QR code at New Hudson Inn in New Hudson. Must be 21 or more. At 971theticket.com. Using the same number you used to call the ticket. Ticket text 248 539 9797. Michigan has apologized for Anderson no one has apologized for what the university did. No one apologized for Bo. No one apologized for Don Cameron. There was no apology for Thomas e. Easthook for failing to do his job on several different occasions. I have not heard apologies for the coach, athletic director, former service of vice president, and university president from 1968 to 2003. That's 45 years.
largest selection of Ram inventory. Lisa 2021 Ram 1500 Laramie Crew Cab 4x4 with all the toys for only $269 per month. That's right. Travel loaded Ram Laramie. Only $269 per month. There's only one place to go for the best selection, price, and sales experience. It's Kelly Family Dodge and Ram. Worry about credit? Forget it. We approve almost everyone. 0% financing for up to 84 months. He's a little one. Select not just to your demo savings of about $13,500. Playoff basketball is here. Hey, it's Jeff Rieger, and before you bet on any of the postseason games, you need to check out BetQL. BetQL analyzes every game to help you make the smartest possible bets. Sometimes a spread is off by a few points, or the total is way too high or low. BetQL finds those opportunities so you can take advantage and cash in. Are you ready to win more consistently? Visit BetQL.com and use promo code TICKET for 20% off. That's 20% off with promo code TICKET at BetQL.com. Tigers fans, single game tickets for all Tigers home games July through September go on sale tomorrow at 10 a.m. Don't miss the Red Sox, Rangers, Blue Jays, and more. For information, visit Tigers.com slash tickets. This hour of instant feedback brought to you by Mike Caparo of National Benefit Plan. For affordable life insurance, call 877-734-2200. talking about Kathy Clay just takes away from NASA. No, it doesn't. It helps tell the story. So my question, you know, again, is why is this being reported differently? So, look, I have theories, you have theories. It's fine. I just want to know why and, and get your theory. Because because between the play-by-play guy victim shaming, between the head coach saying something stupid about Bo, the whole, the Bo I knew routine, and it's like, okay, guys, at what point do we disarm and go, it is more probable than not, who knew? So let's get to the action phase of this. 
It, it, it is crazy to me. Yeah, well, Mike, I, I, when I sit there and I, and I look at the article that Mitch Album did, and, and here's the quote uh, from the article, this is a level of terror that one human monster named Robert Anderson allegedly inflicted on students, athletes, and hundreds of others who came to him in the naive belief that a doctor has sworn by the Hippocratic oath do you no harm. Key word in that sentence, one human monster. Right. Who enabled that monster? How about we ask that question, Myth? But the thing is, okay, fine. But after reading that article, natural curiosity kicked in. And it was funny because you were like, hey, why don't you do that? And I'm like, Mike, Sorry, I'm, I'm already I'm having doing trouble it. Hearing because you. I got up this morning. It was like, I, I, what do you have to say with the NASA thing? And it's not to compare, okay? This isn't a, a power ranking. This isn't, this was worse than that. I just wanted to know, did he come with the same veracity, the same intensity? And here's what he had to say. Simon is gone for a reason. Hollis, despite his claims, is gone for the same reason. The NCAA is coming. Michigan's attorney general is coming. The federal government is coming. The eyes of the world are here. Better open the doors, answer the questions, report any and all wrongdoing. No hush calls from authority. No hiding behind protecting the kids when you're really protecting your program. So how come he's not asking Michigan to open the doors? Notice John there, Taffer man. says, bust open the books. <laughs> Nowhere in there did I hear one long person in Larry Nass. No, nobody it, does. Why isn't he saying 36 year reign of terror, this school has a lot to answer for, they need to be fully transparent, we need to find out who enabled Robert Anderson. Oh no, Mitch ain't on that energy. The local media, oh no. Oh no. Now it's all this, well, I mean, it was a long time ago. They're all dead. Which is not true, by the way. According to him, they're dead. Stop looking at Bo. Don't flip the pyramid upside down. There's only one person there. Okay? Don't look at Bo. Don't look at Kenny. He has no ask of the school to participate in, in an investigation. Michigan State, uh, you better open up everything. Don't hide behind anything. So Full why is it different? Tra transparency. So wh that's the question for the people. Why is it different? My theory? Well, I know you. Oh, okay. I know, I know you. you can still buy the book. Get it on Amazon. He wrote a book about Bo. So what do you expect him to say? You, you think he's going to actually come out here and give you something I, salacious? No, it's not, no. it's not salacious to write the truth. No, you're That's right. That's what your job is. And if you don't want to do it anymore, don't. Go to the beach. Tell the truth, not your version of the truth. Kyle, 97 on. What's up, Kyle? Hey, uh, you guys talked a lot about culture uh, ties falling in. Uh, I got two points. I guess it's just like... I think you got to separate a little bit uh, the Anderson stuff and uh, the Bo stuff, just because uh, I think I think the Anderson stuff is going to be long and drawn out and kind of ugly, and I don't know if uh, U of M is going to handle it all that well. To be honest, um, having and being an alumni myself, like all the recent scandals just have not been handled very well in my opinion. And it's not, it's not all entirely their fault. It seems like nowadays no one's ever happy with how anything is handled. So um, that's one thing. And but the second thing, the more, more uh, important point, I think, is uh, this is an opportunity for the Michigan football program to really just rebrand themselves. I think they're, they're living in the past um, as, you know, Bo team. And I think you guys were saying, like, uh, Harbaugh, you know, he's out there every single Saturday. Uh, playing Halloween in a clown costume, and the results are just aren't there. He's not, he's not winning. He's not doing very well. And then you know you got, they really missed the opportunity when you know Irving got ousted in Ohio State to kind of take over the Big Ten East. And they, you know, Ryan Day's doing really well now. So, he's, and, uh, so Kyle, uh, I think at Michigan State also doing, you know, doing good things. We're gonna, we're gonna lose out on recruits. At the uh, you know, hold on, we're talking about two separate things. I mean, Kyle, hold on. Here, here's. Here's what I think you want to say and you're not saying. You have an opportunity to get out of this vortex of, of, of being beholden to Michigan man, ball, and the team, the bits, the team 134, the, the those who step. All of that stuff is a myth. The reality is you've won one national title since World War II. The reality is You've gone 17 years without winning the Big Ten. And you're not going to win it this year. So chalk up 18. 
You do have a chance if it goes this way and Bo is actually erased. You have a chance to kind of set yourself free of it. Because a lot of schools do this. Rico brought this up before Alabama did it for years. Oh, you had to have known Bear Bryant to coach there. And you know what Alabama largely did outside of that magical Gene Stallings team in, in 92? They sucked. Like, it, it, you know, you wanted to make it about football, we'll make it about football. Now, as far as Harbaugh dressing up like Bo, I'll say it to you again. If Bill O'Brien showed up in bad khakis, an Apex One zip-up, and black cleats with glasses, he would have been thrown off campus the first game. The guy who replaced Joe Pa could not dress like Joe Pa. Jim Harbaugh with that thin block M, that didn't come back until he came back. The whole cleats and the, and, and, and the, all you can't, the horn rim glasses, gotta go. Mosey on down to the M Go Blue Club or whatever the hell it's called, the, the, the M Den. Nike makes lots of good stuff, go find something else. Get a polo shirt, it'll work. Get a big block M hat like Lloyd used to wear. Even wear it high on your head like Lloyd used to. Figure it out. But the idea that these remnants of Bo are going to be here when football season starts, I just, I would be, I, I just, I would be, I'd be like, what? I would, I'd be there. Is it possible? How? <laughs> because uh, you have a civil war going on. You got a large faction of people who will, I told you, Mike, will give you Dr. Anderson. And, and this Mitch article basically was the rallying cry. We'll give you Dr. Anderson. Production. If, 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 if you squeeze us, we may even throw in Don Cannon. Bo's off the table. Bo is non-negotiable. But the problem is what's becoming abundantly clear is he was told in different decades, he was told multiple times, right. and the result was the same. The but doctor was still there. But he can't be dead. He can't defend himself. We can't hear his side of the story. Okay, what but would no, his side be? Hold on. Hold on. What would his side be? Here's the thing. He's dead. He can't defend himself. Okay, got that. Check, check. But you know what? People who are still alive giving eyewitness account of saying, this is what I said. Why would these people feel the need in 2021, I'm going to come up with a way to slander and just smear Bo's name? No, chances are. They're telling the truth. Chances are they're dragging up bad memories from the past to let the people know, guys, he, he knew. He knew with me, too. And uh, you, you're getting people more and more coming out saying, yeah, he, I told him, I told him, I told him. But yet and still, you'll have people who will say, he's dead. Can't defend himself. Well, here's the thing. We already got Bo's. We need his side of the story. No, we already got Bo's side of the story when it comes to his opinion of leaders and whether they get to say, I didn't know. He dead. That book's not. What was that book? Was that book written by a? Uh, uh, I was about to writer. I was about to take a cheap shot there. I won't do that. The point is, he said it. You don't get to say I don't know because I don't know means you do dumb for your job. Plus, no offense, guys. Everything we know about Bo is he was a taskmaster and knew everything that was going on. Now, the why he kept Anderson around, I don't know the answer. But here's the interesting part. The answer doesn't matter. The answer doesn't matter because we know the abuse happened and we know he kept him around. Why? It's kind of immaterial. But that's just my version of it, I guess. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, listen. We'll get your calls next. You heard uh, Northville Lumber. We've talked about him a time or two, a thousand. Uh, the Trex decking leader. Nobody sells more of it anywhere on planet earth Northville lumber anybody tells you they sell more trex decking they're a deadbeat liar they have the largest selection you bet on northville you're going to win period trex is in stock there's no special orders needed everything's in stock all the time you're a pro builder remodeler stop gambling with the competition they're probably getting their product from northville anyway so what the hell are you doing get what you need now and get it at the best price it's northville lumber from the design center to the lumber yard to the warehouse stock the stuff that other places can't or won't. Northfieldlumber.com or give them a call. It's Northfield Lumber. Hi, I'm David Hall from Hall
Financial. We are so proud that we now have over 3,000 five-star reviews from our clients with the majority of our loans closing in 10 business days or less. Call 248-308-5000 or go to callhallfirst.com. All Financial, MLS ID, 146-7435, Equal Housing Lender. Company presents. And Doug. And we're back with Glimu, Emu, and Doug for the final question. Category is things you climb. All right, Limu, what do you think? You sure? We're going with Liberty Mutual customizes your car insurance so you only pay for what you need. Uh, oh, so close. We were looking for stairs. Huh. Only pay for what you need. Liberty, 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 Liberty. Get Dad the perfect gift now at Macy's Father's Day Sale with an extra 25% off his favorite designers with your coupon or Macy's card. That's on top of already great deals for him, like Swim from Club Room starting at $9.99 and his new favorite jeans, just $19.99. Or shop specials like 50% off Bulova watches. Plus, get your gifts even faster with same-day delivery powered by DoorDash. Now at Macy's. Savings off regular sales, clearance prices, exclusions apply. Some things just go better together, like a five-quart jug of Napa full synthetic motor oil and a platinum filter for $26.48. It's like bacon and eggs, hot dogs and mustard, or Joni and Chachi. Ask your dad about it. That's Napa full synthetic and a platinum filter for $26.48. Quality parts, helpful people. That's Napa know-how. Napa know-how. General State's pricing. Sales price is not included with state local taxes or recycling fees. Offer ends 6 21 to churches today and experience a true original. Bourbon Black Pepper Smokehouse Chicken is back. Peppered and kissed with our bourbon blaze. Only in churches, only five bucks. Churches bringing that down home flavor. Offer valid at participating location. And let your voice be heard. Call the D Las Vegas 97 on the ticket studio line at 248-539-9797. The D Las Vegas, your home for Detroit sports in Vegas. Radio.com is now Odyssey. Download the Odyssey app and listen to 97.1 The Ticket and all the sports, news, music, and podcasts that move you. I went to see Dr. Anderson. And when I went to see Dr. Anderson, obviously there's difference in body parts between one's head and one's below. He decided that in the middle of the conversation that I was having with him to get a referral that he was going to reach down and grab what in Yiddish we would call the BC. I immediately went back to Bo after walking out of his office. I did not get a referral because I just felt something was wrong. And I went into Bo and I said, this just happened. The employee that Bo was said, go to Don Canham, who was his employer as the athletics director. I went into Don Canham's office, said, something's wrong. He sat there and stared at me, said nothing. Well, that was Richard Goldman yesterday. A a a again, the press conference. We weren't on the air yesterday, guys. Tigers had a 2-10 in Kansas City. It is what it is. But we're here today. A lot of people want to talk about it. And we've asked the question. I mean, again, I don't know how you hear accounts like that. And out of that, it's, well, Robert Anderson. That's the story. It's like, it, it, again, Don Canham, Bo Schembechler. Michigan football, 36 years. This guy was abusing students, football players, athletes, men and women. And nobody wants to talk about who enabled them? That's insanity. So, we're out. Right. Would I rather be talking about game three tonight? I mean, of course. Nobody's a bigger hockey fan than me. Hey, you're right. I'd rather be talking about the 10-day uh, contract the Phoenix Suns have of uh, Cliff Paul. 
that as uh, yeah, they just signed Cliff Paul to a 10 day deal. Uh, the NBA's got Mustache. a problem. The NBA has got a problem. Chris Paul, the Anthony Davis thing, the Kawhi thing. Like, you need your best players out there. Now, I don't need to hear from LeBron. I don't need to hear from you. Especially when you decided to take ball four on the vaccine issue. I don't need to be hearing from you about nothing. Like it's LeBron's pregame talk, right? I don't need to hear from you. Not again, you, LeBron. Oh, this is pregame talk, right? He's in the. Western Conference Finals. You know what I mean. Now, now he's a chatty Catholic. He had a chance to do something good, chance to do something right. I've explained that to you. I like. don't want to hear it. I've explained that to you. David, the chicken text, and then we'll get to the people. It says, look into the fall. What kind of picture do you even envision for football this year? Will I, there be empty seats, decreased booster support? No, no. No, if they take the bow statue down, you will have some short-term pain. There's going to be some old heads. No, you won't. What? You already have Brandon no, Dog no, no. Whistling. You, you, you will have people angry. But think about this. For everybody that's angry, you're going to have people in support saying you did what was right. Those seats will be filled. You will have 110,000 people. Oh, that, that people. I agree with. I meant the whole booster support thing. Oh, the booster support You'll thing. have some old heads who will never forgive them if they take that oh, statue. Oh, right. They, they, they'll have their own little rally. Remember, hey, remember like when they were getting ready to get rid of Rich Rod, so they hey. had to have a rally for him off campus? Let's check in on Brandy's petition. <laughs> Oh, was at the local mall, wasn't it? No, it was like at the state theater or something. It was like all in for Rich Rod. Do you know to this day, they, they, they had these rally tiles saying all in for Rich Rod, gone. Yep. You can't. I, I have been trying to search and find one for my collector's item in the man cave. You can't find them anywhere. They don't exist anymore. So it's like, like, like an Atlanta Falcons Super Bowl champions t-shirt and they all get sent to like Guatemala yeah. and there's kids on the beach wearing them and you're like, but they didn't win the Super Bowl. That's what the, remember when 60 Minutes did that? Yeah. And they're like, where does the loser stuff go? It goes to third world country. All the Bill shirts <laughs> no, are no, there. Right. These got burned. I'm a, I don't no, know no, what happened. No, it's a kid in like, I don't know, Bolivia and he's got an all in for Rich Rod thing as he's sitting in school. Mike, no. I would pay top dollar for an all-in for Rich Rod towel. They don't exist. They were all collected. You know what? Any They're video. right there with those silver shiny state jerseys when they got blasted by Duke, and we never saw them again. Alan Anderson crying into Paul Davis's shoulder. Yeah. What a now, night. That's the one I want. Yeah. Another, another big showing by Izzo in the non-conference. 40, 40 to 8. <laughs> One last. Good go. Bully for him. That Good was. Go. That wasn't beating Duke. Good go. It, it doesn't. There's nobody there. All right. What are they, we doing? We have to get back to the seat. They beat Zion. We have to. We have to beat David the ticket tax. Coverage is so pathetic nationally. I moved to Dallas and only seen two minutes of coverage from ESPN. Text my cousins back in Detroit about it, and they had no clue what was going on. Darius and Dallas. You know what? That's that is true because a good friend of mine called me and said, "Hey, so what's all this Michigan stuff going on? What's everybody? What are, what are people talking about?" I'm like, "Are, are you are you serious?" She's like, "Yeah, I have no idea. What's what is what is this all about? Who else talks about? Primarily the other shows on the station don't talk." Right. She was appalled. Like, really? They don't hit it a little bit, but like this they're not covering it the way we're covering it. Right. When I told her the story, she was like, are you serious? Why isn't this every place? The newspapers yesterday. Here, I want someone else to explain this to me. Now, I don't care who wrote it. You're writing about Michigan football players talking about their abuse at, at the school while they played football at a press conference in front of the football stadium, and you're filing those pieces under education. Hmm. Or you put it behind the paywall. Bring it. I don't. You do. There you go. And away we go. Kenny! Hey! So, uh, to your point, Mike. <laughs> Let's go Islanders and deep. Come on! It's not like we're just shouting into the oblivion when we discuss this, though. Every time we get full rack of calls, this right. isn't like a story that nobody cares about, that we're just angry old men yelling into the sky. No, stuff. we handle our business between two and six. Kenny, it's what we talked about, brother. Either, uh, either we're getting the only... You know, uh, the only people in town who want to talk about this, 
or it's actually a big story. I think it's the latter. Guys, no offense, I could bring up Zion being unhappy in New Orleans, I might not get a call. You want me to bring up the Ben Simmons thing, have a little bit of fun, Matt Manning tonight? Let me tell you something. You're not gonna have a lot of people interested. This is a massive story. It's all in how you talk about it. If you want to be dismissive and play pretend, you can. If you just want to try to have fun and not do serious radio, you can. I think we're doing what we need to do. We're doing we did the same thing I did when I was at Michigan State. Every day something new was coming out, we were doing it. And I sat here day after day after day, and the only stuff I took exception to was ESPN slandering two men. But I didn't know nothing about nothing when it came to Larry Nassar. Larry Nassar could have served him a cup of coffee. They wouldn't know who the hell he was. Oh, and then we had to re-adjudicate things that were already put through the legal system or put through the campus policy system. And both, I mean, Mark D'Antonio did a press conference right after ESPN. And he basically said to the media, kiss my ass. Find one thing I did wrong, I'll leave. I'm out. You know what people found out about Mark D'Antonio? He didn't do anything wrong. But ESPN had you believing he was the captain of a pirate ship. And the Tom Izzo stuff, forget about it. I mean, that went into La La Land. And all the people. See, this is the funny part when Rico talks about, well, you can still buy the book on Amazon. Do you know how many people call Tom Izzo a friend in media? All of these con artists. And nobody back Tom. Nobody. Where was Billis? Where was Dickie V? Where was Greenberg? Where were all the ESPN guys? Oh, I love Tommy Izzo. Let's have some pasta. Where were they? They didn't do nothing. Nothing. So I do have a problem. And now listen, blasting Tom is like a pastime to me. I happen to like Tom. I don't like all the results. And at Syracuse Ben Carter game, I'm sitting here screaming, Tom, get off the cross. You're acting like a martyr. You played a guy with a bionic leg. I don't care. You win, I'm nice. You lose, I'm not. But Rico, the media impugned the character, one of the best guys in the sport. So I don't want to hear now about Mitch and his stupid book that nobody bought and how he can't cross some, what, mythical line? Then go to one of your three houses. Go take a vacation. Leads me to wonder how much research goes into writing a book about the Fab Five and you knew nothing and writing a book about Bo and you knew nothing. What do you want from me? I want, I want to stick these earbuds in my eye. I don't know <laughs> what to do. Oh, now you see when I was just rubbing my face. You, what you did. That you reached ah! my level. Ah! It does feel good. I can't you believe. reached my level. When you this just, who do I look like the other day? <laughs> Welcome to the world you, of Rico. You, you, because you sit there and say, the question going on here, is this real life? What are we doing here? I say it all the time because it's, it's whether it's this radio station, whether it's the papers, whether it's television. You got a press conference yesterday in front of the big house involving former players, dozens of former Michigan players. Not one network picked it up. I'm sitting here watching it on my phone. I'm going, huh? Don't you dare. Did you go to an internet link that kept dropping? I'm like, okay, maybe somebody else. No, no, no. Hey, and you, 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 you had, you had, like, people, I, I want to be respectful. It's just hard to oh, yeah. but I, I do because it's just, like, you had Molly Kiram, who's married to Jalen Rose, do a soliloquy how Michigan State University should be erased. <laughs> Not the football program. The school should be shut down. She didn't know exactly what for, but she went on TV and said, and yet I can't get an ESPN show to even talk about this and acknowledge its existence. I can't explain why. I mean, I, I have theories, but as the news keeps happening locally, we keep talking about it. You guys have been great about wanting to talk about it. I don't know. Either we're insane, and the only people who, uh, listening are the ones who are calling in, which, if you know this show's track record, that's clearly not true. Or you got a lot of people who have a lot to answer for who don't want to talk about it. Well, no slash. Uh, life is inconvenient. You talk about what you need to talk about, not what you want to talk about. 
not all the time. You don't think I'd rather be talking about Zion right now? You don't think I'd rather be Tombstone bombing Ben Simmons? Talking about the Islanders and Margaritas? Zion, screwing up another cup. Come on, have a margarita tonight. We're going to win this game. They win this game. Come on. Mm-hmm. Go ahead, Rico. Tell them all about it. <laughs> New Bet MGM customers can turn $1 into $100 when they bet on any Detroit Tigers game. Sorry, Mike, this is a Tigers read. Sign up for the Bet MGM app using Rico 100. And when you bet $1 on any Tigers game, you'll get to $100 in free bets, even if your wages are strikeout. That's the kind of teammate that Bet MGM is. Discover innovative parlay selection builders, daily pr- promotions, boosted odds specials, and much more. Down- Come on. Download the app or go to betmgm.com and use code RICO100 to get $100 in free bets if you bet $1 on any Tiger game this season, regardless of the outcome of your wager. Only at BetMGM, the king of sportsbooks, the official gaming partner of the Detroit Tigers. New customer offer paid in free bets. You must be 21 years or older, Michigan only. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-270-7117 for confidential help. Excludes Michigan disassociated persons. Seven one the tickets. Traffic. From the WWJ AM 950 Traffic Center, this report brought to you by Sarah Wayland Chevrolet. 696 westbound at Orchard Lake Road, right side is blocked by an accident. The westbound 696 entrance ramps from Orchard Lake Road also affected. 96 Jeffries eastbound at Beach Daily, right lane and shoulder still blocked by a crash with the backup from before Insta Road. And there's also an accident working in the right lanes of Van Dyke northbound after 9 Mile in Warren. I'm Michelle Pena with traffic. Jeff Carlo here for Sarah Whalen Chevrolet. Take your certified pre-owned vehicle from the best sales team in town. With our world-class customer service and huge inventory, we have the vehicle you want. Visit us online at sarahwhalen.com or call 1-800-WHALEN-1. Find new roads. Hi, Harry Glantz for Capital Mortgage Funding. Rates are at historic lows, and they're not going down to zero. So what are you waiting for? Call 1-800-LOW-RATE and let our award-winning staff help you save money. If you're looking to purchase a new home, refinance your existing home, and you want to save money, call 1-800-LOW-RATE and take advantage of these historic low rates. That's Capital Mortgage Funding, 1-800-LOW-RATE, the best mortgage banker. What are you waiting for? Call 1-800-LOW-RATE. Capital Mortgage Funding is powered by Fairway Independent Mortgage Corporation at MLS ID number 2289, Equal House. Lender. This is the sound of a family of four, <clears throat> all working away on their devices. See, with Xfinity Internet, they now get Wi-Fi speed faster than a gig to handle all the homework, work work, and streaming they throw at it. So no more arguments over who's hogging the Wi-Fi. <laughs> oh, my bad. Xfinity delivers faster Wi-Fi speed to handle a house full of devices. Can your internet do that? Learn about gig Wi-Fi. It's the fastest Wi-Fi you can get, only from Xfinity. Or ask about other speed options. Get started with Xfinity Internet for $20 a month for 12 months with a one-year agreement. Plus, ask about speed two times faster than AT&T. Go to Xfinity.com, call 1-800-XFINITY, or visit a store today. Requires paperless billing and auto pay and 622-21. Restrictions apply. New performance starter, 50 megabits per second internet customers only. Equipment, taxes, and fees extra and subject to change. After term, regular rates apply. Gig speed Wi-Fi requires gigabit internet and compatible like Spy Gateway. Actual speeds vary, not guaranteed. Brownie House. Shop every team in town. College and pro. Come on, it's time to go. Rally House has Father's Day gifts he's sure to love. Get that new gear featuring his favorite Michigan team's newest and most popular styles. Lions, Tigers, Red Wings, Pests, and Spartans, Chippewas, everything Michigan. Rally House. Rally House. It's your city. It's your house. It's a rally. Shop for that in store and online at rallyhouse.com. The COVID 19 vaccine is our best bet at beating the pandemic. One by one, we get strong. One by one, our kids will go back to school. We come together as a community. One by one, we go to concerts to celebrate together. One by one, back to business. As we each get the COVID 19 vaccine, one by one, we can all breathe a little easier. Get vaccination updates and the latest information at oaklandcountyvaccine.com. At Fisher Investments, our clients know we have their backs. How do your clients know that? Because Fisher Investments is a fiduciary, the highest standard for a financial advisor. It means we're there for our clients and always put their interests first. So wait. 
You do it because you have to? No. We do it because it's the right thing to do. Our clients trust us with their retirement savings, and we know how important that responsibility is. So we take the time to really get to know them. Get to know them how? We make sure we understand their unique goals, finances, health, family, and lifestyle, so we can tailor their portfolio to their specific needs. Our goal is to help them achieve a comfortable retirement. Sounds like a big responsibility. You must make big commissions then, right? No, we don't sell commission-based products. We have one single transparent fee that's structured so we do better or our clients do better. Visit FisherInvestments.com to find out why investors like you are switching to us. Fisher Investments, clearly different money management. Investing in securities involves the risk of loss. This hour of the Valenti Show with Rico is brought to you by Capital Mortgage Funding. Call 1-800-LOW-RATE. This hour's ticket signing bonus keyword is STRIPE. Text STRIPE to 72881 for your chance at $1,000. All right, Rico, go ahead. Dealer's choice. Go to whoever you like. You got to get to All right, uh, we'll reset everything top of you. Let's take uh, Cannon Clinton Township. saying I was molested by a doctor because my life is so bad, this is the quick and easy way to make money? Okay, all those 8 million people are going to be probably thousands by the time this is done. Those names will never get in the paper and they'll never get, you know, figured out and they're going to put millions of dollars. Why would you do that? Well, no, well, let's see. Kwiatkowski's yeah, name is out there. No, 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 no. Ken, you're saying people are basically making up stories to get rich. No, I'm saying that I'm saying that you can't believe it's and you can't believe that it's nobody. It's somewhere in between. Just like you can't believe that both you and they just say, well, Actually, you know what? Ken, Ken, Ken is just like with the uh, the young ladies at Michigan State. If you got documented proof, if you were there, if, if if you're giving your account, who am I to sit there and say, no, nah, I believe you and you, but you, I don't believe. Why would you make this stuff up, Ken? I, I'm not saying, all I'm saying is that because, it's like I said, it's a like said. 
Okay, okay. Kid, okay. Kid, no, 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 Kid, 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 let me ask you this one question. Mike, hold on. Sure. At what point will you officially let go of this bow stuff? What has to happen for you? Um, or, or the answer could be nothing. Um, well, I, I don't know.